There are six things the Lord hates, and the seventh is an abomination. Before I say anything, I will like to start with one, one song. Obu Mado Ndonag. Obu Mado Ndonag. Sam, read for me the book of Proverbs chapter 6 verse 17. Proverbs 6 verse 17. Look for it. Proverbs 6 verse 17. Read. This is an important issue. We need to address it. There are six things the Lord hates and the number seven is an abomination. Hear the word of the Lord. <laughs> Go ahead and read. A, pr a, pr a proud look. A proud look. A lion tongue, a lion tongue, a hand that which who, who shed innocent blood, a hand that shed what innocent blood. Sam, stop there. The Bible said, A proud look, a lion tongue, a hand that shed innocent blood. The Lord hates them all. You just who can get your pen, you can get your book, get ready. To hear the the the, the unhidden truth, truth where he, he, at the year he, he could be a very big lesson. Let's let's go. Follow follow us. The Exodus chapter twenty verse thirteen says, "Have nothing to bear false witness against a neighbor, and do not put the life of an innocent man to death." You, 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 they are life, and you, 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 you feel life, they, they sweet you, but another man life, you feel said now waiting, you, you go use, you go, you go use allegation, accusation, many forms of iniquity to take a man's life. The Bible says, six things the Lord hates, and the number seven, it says, do not share the, the, the blood of an innocent man. No use your hand with life with life where you don't know how God will take creator. Now you don't you do you don't plan. God warned us now. seriously, say thou shall not kill. Make you not kill, kill, kill. Now what if by Bible you say no kill? The worst thing you can do to any man is not is not sleeping with his wife. It's not disconnecting him from people that, that give him money or people that take him to her life. The worst the thing you can do to a man is to take his life. That's the worst thing you can do to any creature is to take his life, to stop him from breathing. That is the worst thing you can do to any man. And God himself is so angry with it. Sam, read for me the book of Numbers 35 verse 30. We need to let them hear what God is saying about taking the life of another man. Numbers 35 verse 30. Read. Whosoever, whosoever that killeth any person. Whosoever that killeth any person. Read. The murderer, the murderer, he, he, he shall be put to death. The murderer shall be put to death Aye. by the mouth of witnesses. By the mouth of witnesses, close the Bible. The Bible says, Whosoever that killeth a person, whosoever that takes the life of any man, whosoever that, that seizes a man from Britain shall be killed. Kill her, we won't live. Killer, where one live? This word, we, we, we find an expression in your life. I'm so pained with what is happening around our society now. We have gotten to the stage where people take that big bold step to take the life of another man. You go there, house. You, you go there, your own. What if you, you go there, they think, now how to take another man's life? A life that you, you did not create. A life that you did not conceive. A life that you did not make. You took it and you went as far as trying to close the justice of that life. Person go get belay. 
from day one. He, he, he noted the belay. He, he reached nine months. He born him. After he born him, he, he, he trained him. After they train him, boom, from, from nowhere, you can not take the life. The Lord swore in his name. He said, Our oh God, the Lord of hosts, we have avenged the life of an innocent man. God, no, he, 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 no people who close his eyes for this kind of matter. He said, I am the mother of the motherless, the, the father of the fatherless. Judgment, he, 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 they come. There is no connections in this world. There is nothing you have in this world that will spare your life if you take the life of another man. You know, you know, president, you know, governor, you know, uh, native daughter, you know this one, you know this one. No, be many death of matter where you take human being life. We are not saying rest in peace to our brother because he's a weak lad. We are not saying rest in peace to our brother because he did not fight. We are saying rest in peace to him because we know where he is is better than where we are now. I never want to put mad for this matter. The book of Matthew chapter 7 verse 12 says, Go to others what you wish them to do to you. As you want my person die, pre pre prepare your cuts. Pre pre prepare your casket. That is where you 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 you, you not say uh, if you do a person you, you go pay them now what did they go to they, they go do you you kill somebody and you are running for your life who are you this guy like a bird this guy you are like a bird you are a wanderer you are you you are a wanderer you will be you will be a wanderer he can no fear you will fly you will not see where to you fly. cannot hide away from the sun. You cannot hide away from the from the breath, from the breath from the air that you breathe. You can there's nothing you can hide in this life, you hide from the sun. Book of Isaiah chapter 48, verse 29 says, Ah, there is no priest for the wicked. There is no single atom of peace for the wicked, says the Lord of hosts. It is not man that said it. It is not a judicial that said it. It is not a person that said it. The Lord of hosts said there is no peace for the wicked. Even if you get peace, you go to drink your peace. If you peace finish, you go, you, you go drink them. There is no peace for you. You not go get peace. This is a warning. This is a warning. We are sending a warning to evil doers, those who perpetrate crime, those who plan. Even if you are, you are connected to how they, how they did it, to take the life of the Bible says, run away from those who plan to take the life of another man. Say, run away, run away from those who plan to take the life of another man. The Bible wants to run away from those, those, those kind of persons, run away from their group, stay away from them. Isaiah, to Isaiah 49, verse 26. And I will feed them, and I will feed them that oppress thee. I will feed, hear the word of the Lord. This is the Lord talking, this is the Lord assuring us of those. Who, who fight, who pursue our life. He said, read. And I will feed them that are oppress thee. And I will feed them that oppress thee with their, their own flesh. With their own flesh. I will feed them. They will eat their own flesh. Read. And they shall be drunken with their own blood. They shall be drunken with their own blood. Read. As who sweet wine, as sweet wine, they shall be drunken with their own blood. Some go to Proverbs 26 verse 27. These are the words of the Lord against the wicked. Who do who do get a, a pit? Who so over that they get a pit? Shall fall to who daring? Shall fall daring? And he that rolled a stone, and he that rolled a stone, it will return and. <laughs> I say amen to this one. Some say amen to this one. He that digged a pit, I guess another man shall fall inside it. And he that rolled a stone, ah, my God. The stone will burn and consume and kill him. <laughs> there is no peace for the wicked. The Bible says, I will remember their sins. God says, I will remember their sins. The book of Exodus. To the fourth generation, I will hurt them. They are saying to the fourth generation, fourth generation. Stop. 
don't worry i will read i will read this one with my, by myself psalms 34 verse, verse 21 it says some hear the word say evil shall slay the wicked evil now you go to who 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 the wicked who the who kill who kill, who kill other people now you go be your oh 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 now evil shall slay the wicked now that thing now, now that thing when you use your hand who who cut yourself now now you go who kill and those who hate righteousness those who hate righteous men shall be led to desolate. Una they see through, so una see they oh, oh, cover them. He go they come after oh, una children, oh, una, oh, una, oh, una children, children. Sam, here another one. The book of Psalms chapter 11 verse 6. Hear this one, and our cause is this. He says, upon the wicked, he shall rain snails. Ha! He, 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 that is the best for them. He okay. shall rain fire. He shall rain brimstone. And and an horrible tempest shall come upon them. If we are not doing the, the right thing for this matter, the the, the, the plague upon the children of Egyptian is going to come upon on our children and on our children, children one by one. If we are not bring bring justice to 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 where they take the life, we are not going to take on our own children's life. For the righteous, the Lord will keep him. And his family. Now God go keep anybody who don't come at the they, 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 they talk through. When they see say they keep person, when they take person, he say he's no food. Now God go, go, go. God bless the word of the Lord.